I almost brought this with and I thought uh probably good idea to not do that what's going on guys welcome to the video it's early it's about five o'clock I'm fully packed uh, puppy eyes and still pretty sleepy but we're about to leave for Arizona um, yeah the cool thing about these trips I've really I didn't I don't think I mentioned with the LA one is like if you own a business and you go on a trip you can write the whole entire thing off as long as you do one thing on that trip business related so like I'm doing two photo shoots so I can write off the entire trip the flights the I mean I still have to pay for it obviously but it gives you a tax break in the future so food flights like your freaking checked bag everything it can all be written off um, so yeah I mean if you own a business you need to be taking advantage of these things even if you're a sole proprietor and you don't own like an LLC or any corporation you can still take advantage of tax right off so enough about that little lesson let's go to Arizona that's kind of weak that's that's egg yeah I guess that's Good yeah, it is. Yeah, there's only five bucks, too. Really? Yeah. That's probably how much your parfait was, right? So I forgot an SD card reader for my laptop. I didn't bring the adapter, so I'm going to try to Amazon one to the hotel. You know if they do that? I think it's yours too. It's gotta be. Yeah? Yeah, it's yours. All right. I'd say either the Honda, the Chevy, or the Elantra right here. Do the Chevy? Woo! Okay. Silent. Nice and clean. Alright, let's do it. Uh, I thought you wanted to get married. <laughs> I Not thought yet. I was already married. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe that. I mean we got the rental and it's already broken. You so pretty. We made it. Oh, the scooters. Have you ever used those? Those are amazing. That was like my LA trip right there. That's how we got around the scooter. Yeah. I didn't know we had like a pullout couch. That's for when we have the girls come sleep over. <laughs> oh shit, it's not bad. I didn't know we would have. Just like it too. I didn't know we would have this thing. It literally just took over the desk. You didn't need the desk for anything, did you? Alright, good, because I'd feel really bad. <laughs> Just get my setup. Dude, I've always wanted to try something like that. Oh, yeah, by the way, um, kind of related, kind of unrelated, but I was talking to Christy, and she wants to get a group of people together to do the. Uh, remember how we were talking to JoJo about the Wrigley Field? Warrior Dash? 
Spartan, Spartan yeah. race? It's in November. Yeah, yeah, she wants to get a group together, and I said I could get the boot camp crew together. It'll be cold, but it'll be fun. Yeah. yeah. I actually might see my trip meeting. I need to do some. What is it like a half marathon or five k? For that, you can choose whichever one. You could do the five k, the ten k, or like the one mile. Because I might be doing a half marathon. 13.2 or whatever the hell it is, 13.3, what? Yeah, talking to it. Cool. But it's, it's gonna be, it's gonna be, when are you, gonna, it's gonna be, when are you gonna train for that? Utah? That's awesome. I think it's like February or something, so. We've been here like five minutes and we're already at the gym. What are you talking about? Nice towel service. Well. I mean, at least you, we could do, I mean, I'm probably going to do fasted cardio every morning. So, at least you can get that done. You can get a little uh, pre-bar bicep pump, some chest. It'd be kind of cool to film a, a workout in here to show people like what they can do with just like little equipment. We could do that. It'd be kind of cool. Like arms, you could do arms in here. Nice little oh look at there's a little, little waterfall they do have a uh, hot tub yeah so I mean if it does cool off one of the nights you can grab some beers and go in the hot tub probably, probably what are these cold towels yeah what the heck that's some uh some good service there a row machine yeah, I mean, whatever, at least fasted cardio. I'll probably film a, a little 30 minute hotel workout. This is a, a day one skin color check. We're gonna be red as shit after. All right, so we're here at Walmart. What'd you get? Some smart ones? I've never had those ones. Watching the macros? <laughs> we don't care. Just used to looking at it. Yeah. No, I know every single thing I look at. I look, I check the macros, and I apparently carbs on seventeen. I get bad. those every week. Yeah. yeah. There's one thing at thirteen, like a breakfast thing. That's not bad. So people think, people say it's like unhealthy when you look when you do that right away. We should do a full day of Oreos and just like eat all these different kinds. All right, this is a dangerous section. Right now, we, I got some. I forgot swim trunks, so I had to get these. It is no joke hot here, baby. Woo! Sorry about that. It is freaking hot as shit in Scottsdale, man. But I love it. It's not like a sweaty Florida hot, so it's not humid, so it's not too bad, but it's hot. All right, we're back at the hotel. We got the grocery haul. I'm going to get a cart right now. Uh, I'll show you what we got. And then we're gonna eat, and then we're gonna go lift. Bunch of water, Gatorades, some Mountain Dews, so much protein bars. Four boxes. Four, five, didn't we get five? Yeah, four. Oh yeah, only four. One, two, three. Oh, I thought that was on there. Sweet. Righty back. Wow. <laughs> and then I ran out of sleep supplements, so I got Dream Water, four pack. Uh, I forgot swim trunks because I'm a dummy, so I also got those. And we got some ketchup. Oh yeah. Cheez-Its. Popcorn. Solo cups for beer pong. Oh, we did get five. Yeah, birthday cake. That's awesome. And then we're gonna have some chicken and wedges. And then we're gonna go to the gym. Woo! There's more than like double. Jeez. Yeah, that's good. This is this is a freaking It's all crusty, man. Yeah. 
Yeah, three fourths of the cup. Actually, no, most of it was good. I just feel like this was a lot. Of Grape. All right, now I'm training hammies and glutes. What do you got? Back? Back attack? It's good. I did it yesterday. It's actually a really good workout. Not bad, actually. Not good, not bad. Kind of tastes like crap. All right, guys, day one in Arizona. We are headed to Anytime Fitness. We're going to. Um, we don't really know how nice it is. There's no pictures online or anything like that, but it's about 4 30. And there's a really nice one like 16 minutes away, but yeah, we're kind of tired. We just kind of want to go. This one's like five minutes away. So we're heading over there right now. And after that, I don't really know. I mean, we both got up at like four o'clock. Um, it's 6.30 back home. That's what we're used to. It's 4.30 here. We're, we're, we want to do something tonight, but we're probably just going to get back from the gym, uh, shower, eat, and then just chill probably just chill might as well get a good night's sleep probably gonna do a lot of stuff the rest of the weekend so yeah and the reason we're going to an anytime fitness is because uh we haven't looked up any gyms in the area but we are gonna definitely check out some badass gyms we want some cool gyms in scottsdale so we can get some cool footage that's the plan it's freaking hot it's hot i need to, i had to turn down the air to make this and i am dying all right gonna hit okay this sucks I'm doing hamstrings and glutes today how terrible is that how terrible is that I'm hiking all weekend too such a dumb decision but oh well hamstrings and glutes in three two fast forward clip till we get there one This is so nice. What's going on guys? I'm back from Arizona. I'm doing this commentary the day of the upload. And yeah, as you kind of just saw a little bit here, you'll see throughout the video, this gym was unreal. It was sick. It made me jealous. I wish we had one of these over here. But anyways, I started with the dumbbell stuff like deadlift, six sets of six with a close stance. I actually did feet touching. After that, I moved on to the lying leg curl. I do not have this at my anytime over here in Plainfield. Neither of them do. So uh, this is a machine that I've missed a lot since leaving LA Fitness a couple years ago. But they had it here, and I was really excited to see that. And also, I figured out that I like pre-core better than life fitness. They had all pre-core stuff. But for the lying leg curl, it was three sets of four drops six. And then I moved into a seated leg curl, which was three sets of 30 but yeah the, the pre-core just felt a lot smoother if that makes sense it's kind of weird but never really used a lot of pre-core stuff but i did like it better after that i moved into the leg press so this is an angled leg press it's just a little bit different angle obviously that it's gonna hit but for this i did four sets of four drop six and this one is the one where i like kind of struggling to walk after this one got to me um so i guess i could say I, I did like the angled leg press compared to a regular leg press the area that i'm in right now is like the purple turf crossfit area i guess you could say i mean it was pretty crazy to see. like i've been to any times with purple turf areas but this one was massive it was huge and they had so many different types of equipment they even had like one of those push sled things um, for that, the V-grip goblet squat, I did three sets of eight. And then I didn't really feel like setting up a whole hip thrust station, you know, with the barbell and the bench and all that stuff, and they didn't have a machine for it, so I figured I would still do something for glutes. So I did some abductors 
get a little glute work in. And then I did a, I wanted to do a single leg variation and this is what I came up with. I hate this machine, I do, unless I'm doing single leg things. So for this, I did three sets of eight. And then after that, I did some cardio. So I hope you guys are enjoying the video and enjoy the rest of it. There's not too much left, but I will uh, talk to you in the next one. My calves are sore. If we're climbing a mountain tomorrow, it's gonna be rough. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe not. I have no idea. We have no plans. It's kind of nice though. Looks like it's really nice. They have CBD as well. Wow. Wow. I'm already done. You don't like it that much? I was gonna get. It's like, I feel like there's better flavor. I was gonna get mango, but I was like, I'm just really feeling just plain vanilla. Twenty nine carbs, fifty five grams of protein, creatine, glutamine, and BCAs. Not like really that filling though. That's the thing. For no? me, no. Okay, so it's about seven o'clock. We are, so our hotel does this thing where from 5.30 to 7.30, you get two free drinks every single day and like free appetizers and snacks and nachos and stuff. So we're gonna go down there and catch like the last end of that. And then uh, at 7.30, they bring out milk and cookies. And then we don't know what we're gonna do after that, but that's the plan for now. So. I'll bring you along. Lolo's chicken and waffles. Well, what was the rating? What was your rating? I give it a nine out of ten, only because they didn't they didn't put my cream cheese on my red velvet freaking pancakes. That's a point off. Yeah, that's a point off for sure. Like 